show you the recruitment maneuver on a patient who is on a pressure control mode with an FiO2 of 50%, a PEEP of 10 and a pressure above PEEP of 12. What we will try to do is give a constant pressure of 40 centimeters of water for 40 seconds and look at the response in the oxygenation and the compliance of the lung. What we will do is go and change the mode to the CPAP mode or the pressure support mode. Put the pressure support above PEEP as 0. Increase the PEEP to 40. You can give oxygen breath so this 100% oxygen is maintained because there will be no breathing at this point of time. And then accept these settings. We can go to the alarm profile and set an apnea time of 40 seconds so that at the end of 40 seconds we will get an alarm and we get to know our maneuver is over. We have set high pressure alarms, very low minute ventilation respiratory rate alarm and then we go to see the graphs. And you can see there is a constant line on the pressure graph which is at 40 centimeters of water. There is no flow and no volume delivery. You can see an expiratory minute volume alarm being raised that is expected because there is no tidal volume delivery during this period of time. And as soon as the 40 seconds will be over, we have got a backup mode. So you can go press that, go to the previous mode and accept. So you come back to your previous mode again. Whenever we do a recruitment maneuver, we should sedate the patient well and paralyze because high pressures are being applied. We should also make sure that the patients have adequate volume status because such high intrathoracic pressures can cause hypotension. And always remember that a recruitment maneuver of this nature can cause lung injury including a pneumothorax. So we always be ready for these eventualities whenever you do a high peep maneuver.